Hey Bert and Neil Wilson, what do you make of that this afternoon? Uh, much better away performance, Liam can set a sensational. Nicky Devlin played well, Luke Lee played well. Missed a couple of chances, but a good draw. Disappointed now, thought we'd better second half, better chances, better keep us safe. And Dean Keats would be really sort of impressed and take courage from the fact that second half produced quite a lot of chances. Work rate was good as well, so. Yeah. Had them on the back foot for a lot, didn't we? Yeah. Gordon had two cracking chances, like I say, keep, keep us safe, it's for him today. Uh, constantly, constantly had them on the back foot for the second half. And I don't, I don't remember one chance there, I don't think, in the first half. Uh, I'd have chucked that before kick off, poor first half, much better the second half. And uh, if I keep that going for the next few games, then you should be alright. And Dean Keats will really take courage from that second half, big chances with Gordon and Jarvis. Could yeah. have nicked it another day. Could have gone, yeah, yeah. worldy from the keeper, and then that's it. Fair play to him, they, they held out. And Dean Keats will really take courage from that second half performance. We've got some hard games coming up, but we'll carry on with that kind of performance, that kind of attitude, we're not going to struggle. And with Oxford and Bristol Rovers winning this afternoon, it would have been a good opportunity to get a win and, you know, extend that gap. I wasn't aware of that, I've not seen the results yet, but perhaps that's not going, that's gone against us a little bit. But we've got to take encouragement from the last two games and the vast improvement the team has shown. Fighting quality second to none. Carry on fighting for that beer to the end of the season. We won't be in the bottom four. And with them Bristol Rovers and Oxford winning today, a win today would have been crucial, wouldn't it? Would have been good, but I think we'd have set up for a draw anyway, the way we've been playing lately, so yeah. we're disappointed we should have won. And what do you make of the influence that Martin O'Connor's made since coming in? It's going to be a good influence. It's a soul war to the club, isn't he? So he's going to have the fans backing as well, so it's good. It's never, it's never a disaster if you get a point away from Ireland. They've just got to win the home games now. And what do you make of the influence since Martin O'Connor's come in? What's the influence he had on the team? Well, it's obvious he's the one standing on the halfway line, pointing at, pointing at all the players, issuing the directions. I think Dino needed somebody alongside him to give him that bit of support. I think Martin's the perfect guy.